Hello traders, FX Bip Collector here. Today is Tuesday, May 16th, and I'm going to be analyzing the Aussie US dollar starting on the monthly, working my way down to the one hour time frame. So on the Aussie dollar monthly, I still think this is going to go up and make a big old up move, which I think is probably going to be an ABC. I do think this is an ABC up over here for the W. I think it's an ABC down for the X and most likely another ABC up for the Y. I believe this is that triple three pattern I think that this last ABC of Y most likely will take out the high of wave four and end up all the way up at one of these two Fibonacci extension levels so let's take a look at that on the weekly time frame on the weekly time frame is where you can start to see the uptrend which I think is an A I still believe that this move down is complete like an ABC of B and I still believe that this is going to start making its way up to make that pattern like I was showing on the monthly time frame most likely a wave C probably going up and taking out these highs and heading all the way up to one of these higher Fibonacci levels so let's take a look at that on the daily time frame. Daily time frame, it looks like a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 of A. I still think this is an A, B, C of B. And this move down right here is a wave C of the bigger A, B, C of B. A nice big impulsive move up, taking out Strutzer. I think that helps prove that this whole thing is over. I think this right here is going to make a higher low, higher low, and I think it's just going to keep on making its way up, making those higher highs and higher lows. So taking it down to the four hour time frame. Four hour time frame, it's kind of hard to pitch on this one, but if you look at all dollar pairs, I do believe this is an A, three waves up for the B, and this last move down is a wave C. We do have a break of Strutzer, which for me does help prove that this wave C really is over. I think this move down is going to make a higher low, higher low, and I still think that it's going to just keep on drifting up and continuing the uptrend to make that big pattern like I was showing on the weekly and monthly time frames. So taking it down to the one hour time frame. One hour time frame, we got a nice and positive move to the upside. And then what happened next is we have one, two, three waves down with an impulsive move up. I think that three wave pattern down was a crutch to this last move up and I think the crutch is most likely already over and I'm sure that it's going to start making those higher highs, higher lows telling me that I am definitely looking for pullback entries on these sort of time frames. If I can get in long at the end of an ABC pullback something like this right here or something like this right there except for now we're looking for longs then those are definitely the trades that I'm looking for for the continuation of this uptrend so don't forget to join my free discord channel the link for that is on the screen and in the description thanks and happy trading